Raman or Ramon, identified with Hadad or Adad, is a type of deity of a later type and introduction. Indeed, Raman may merely be a variant or subsidiary name, meaning as it does, the Thunderer, which was quite a common title for several types of deities. And what happens if you reverse that name? Who does it become? The worship of Kadad was widespread in Syria and Palestine, and he was a god of storms and rains. Almost as if Shutu, the wind demon, is evolving. Shutu and Hadad, both sharing the same characteristics, are both alongside Anu. The defeat of Shutu may have given rise to Hadad, whose symbols were the thunderbolt or the lightning, which he holds in his grasp like a fiery sword, but he bears solar emblems upon his apparel, and seems to wear a solar crown. He does not, however, appear to have had any center of worship in Babylonia, and was probably a god of the Armorites, and through becoming popular with the Babylonians, was later admitted into the Pantheon. At Ashur, in Assyria, he was worshipped along with Anu, with whom he had a temple in common. This building was excavated in 1908, and contained two shrines, but having only one entrance, and the date of its foundation, is referred so far back as 2400 BC. There can be no doubt that the partnership with Anu was a late one. Perhaps it was on Assyrian and not Babylonian soil that Hadad first entered from the alien world. In many of his characteristics, Hadad closely resembled Enlil. Like him, Hadad was designated the Great Mountain, and seems to have been conceived as almost a counterpart of the older god. It is peculiar that while in Syria and Babylonia, Hadad had many of the characteristics of a sun god. In his old home at Syria, he possessed those of a thunder god, who dwelt among the mountains of northern Palestine and Syria, and spoke in thunder, and wielded lightning. But even in Assyria, the stormy characteristics of Hadad are not altogether obscured. Hadad's cult in Babylonia is probably not much older than the days of Kamarabi, 1800 BC, in whose time the first inscriptional mention of him is made. Very similar to the Egyptian Amun-Ri, and if we reverse that name, what do we get? We could also get Romulus and Remus, if those two little guys were chewing on his nipples. The worship of Hadad obtained a stronger hold in the times of the Kassite dynasty, for we find many of its monarchs incorporating his name with their own and altogether affording him a prominent place. 
This is the god worshipped by the nobility. Ramon or Rimon, the counterpart of Amon Ri, the counterpart of Enlo, the counterpart of Anu, the counterpart of Shu Tu, the wind demon, the counterpart of the sun god, Utu, Shamash, son of Sin. Lord Zhu. According to Professor Sayus and Lewis Spence, Haddad, D.O.D., Death of Demuzi, does indeed relate to David, the Beloved One, and the demon children of Bel, God's once demons, are identified as the Beloved Sons of Bel. There is indeed a connection.